youth and the deaths of a Parishville couple following a lengthy chase with the police was back in court today. Trevor Sisto is facing yet more charges in the case. WPTZ's Allison Carey was in the village of Lake Placid courtroom today and joins us live to pick up the story. Allison. George Trevor Sisto faces a long list of charges in both the village and the town of Lake Placid, or the town of North Alba, as well as the village of Lake Placid. He's alleged to have committed numerable crimes during the police pursuit, which ultimately culminated in a fatal accident in Raybrook. Tonight, we're learning that Sisto is no stranger to the courtroom. The defendant from Fort Covington has a criminal record in Franklin County. The district attorney there tells WPTZ Sisto served jail time for a probation violation after he impersonated someone and lied to police about possessing marijuana in 2013. Sisto was also charged with reckless endangerment during an altercation with tribal police in Bombay in 2012. And those are just some of his misdemeanor charges in Franklin County. Today in court, the judge denied the 22-year-old public defender's request for a bail reduction. Next, the case will go to the grand jury for indictment. Once that happens, the village and town charges will likely be combined into one case in county court. Meanwhile, more charges are expected as this, after Sisto's drug test results are complete. I'm Allison Carey, WPTZ News Channel 5.